welcome back to CAD CAM tutorial today we are going to design a very famous toy a fidget spinner nowadays it is very commonly used in the market you will see in every street everywhere this is simple design we will first make a body we will save it into the our uh, folder then later we will take this ba ball bearings from the our uh, system design library so let's see how to do this it's very simple and very easy toy even I also like this toy it's uh, fantastic so let's see so now here let's start to create our fidget spinner body so let's choose top plane a sketch and uh, let's draw first vertical line vertical center line draw two circles exit select both the circles and make relation equal that's fine now define it keep outer diameter 22 millimeter and select this length 30 the gap between two circles keep 30 millimeter okay now choose your circular sketch pattern select this center point and here pattern to entity select this circle okay 360 degree equal spacing and we need three number of not five make three number of instances okay that's fine click fully define okay now choose offset offset key 5 millimeter select this three circles at a time okay that's fine now choose here three point arc now we need to connect that's it the same here select this two circles exit now select both the uh, circles and arc make relation tangent the same thing we will do it for every st stage tangent what else uh, the tangent okay and this is the last point tangent relation so now we define the relation now let's define the uh, radius keep radius 15 millimeter so that it looks perfect our body that's fine okay now see this is the our body now let's define this gap five milli uh, we want to change it make six milli now see the body looks more comfortable and more rigid so we kept uh, gap between two circles six millimeter when you are going to do offset entities choose six millimeter it's up to you uh, select extruded boss now here select this faces and this mid face keep end condition mid plane and thickness uh, let's keep seven millimeter that's enough for our body okay that's fine see this is the body of fidget now choose fillet and here define full sketch fillet the third one face fillet first face uh, no not this one ah uh, this one the full round fillet let's choose fillet 1 in fillet 2 phase 2 and go back and phase 3 now you can see the preview okay 
now let's see it is full round see full face round so this is very nice command full fillet now it looks the body looks a perfect shape fillet now choose here ordinary constant size fillet 0.5 mm and select this all inside faces that's it 0.5 mm radius okay sometime it hangs actually now that's it see so this is our widget widget uh, sorry widget spinner uh, now let's define some color so it looks go to our appearance choose here plastic high gloss plastic how this look buddy this one little how oh, that's fine that's looking blue polished abs plastic wow this color is looking awesome let's save this body save it and uh, create one folder uh, let's go to find uh, our folder uh, where is the uh, fidget spinner let's make our part one body save it now let's start the assembly and here we will fix the bearing okay so just uh, go to directly from here make assembly from part click and your part comes here see now let's see how to fix the bearing here all the circles all the holes are same diameter so just go to your design library select here toolbox once you select toolbox it will ask you add in now select add in oh that's fine this is your uh, now here uh, you can choose any kind of bsi standard now here we open bsi standard now just go to bearings and choose here ball bearings now here you will find three types of bearing here we will use this one angular contact ball bearing just select this one and drag it to this hole press here okay now his detail will come here see now here we will fix the size and everything okay bearing size keep 36 it is suitable for our spinner fidget spinner because we need od 22 that's fine thickness also 7 mm and bore 6 it's no problem that's fine number of balls keep full and here select detailed now you can see the bearing bearing detail now if you comes down it will ask you you want cage or no so select add cage see it looks more realistic select okay now it will ask you to add some more so first select this uh circular face N now see it is become uh, and select okay let's find we will do it one by one this circular face if you will direct to this circular face it will take the position like this okay now let's see right click on the body and select fixed now the body fix this will rotate choose mat select this two faces coincident relation okay here also select this two faces concentric relation and select this two faces coincident relation this face and this face coincident relation here the last one coincident relation okay 
just check once the bearing either see the bearing is rotating very beautifully so now here what we will do we will fix select float and fix this bearing now see it is going to rotate our fidget spinner it looks awesome and uh, we will try to fix it uh, let's do one thing uh, just select origin point and create axis we need one origin point plus any plane not the front plane choose top plane that's fine okay now here select open this window and choose view axis that's fine now right click and float now everything is floating mat select this hole and this axis and here make relation co-centric oh that's fine and uh, let's choose some plane front plane is not top plane clear choose top plane and select this face see it coincident relation it is going to fix with top plane okay that's fine now you can hide this axis now both rotating together and do one thing just take a one position so that uh, it looks gorgeous for us no this adjust the size and everything take it to the middle that's that's fine now take it to the level now save it fidget assembly fidget spinner assembly now right click here motion manager go to motion study and up the window choose here motion analysis and keep the frame per second 50 anything you can is up to you more frame it will give you more accuracy now drag it up to 10 seconds or anything now select motor and select this body circular face because this body we want to rotate this body revolution per second we will keep small and try calculate see <coughs> it's going to calculate that's it 
now play see it's rotating fast not too fast not too slow that's fine so this is the simple toy uh, nowadays it is very famous in the streets you will find in everywhere fidget spinner i hope you like it don't forget to share and uh, like our videos and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solidworks thanks for watching